Hi, and welcome back to Cheeky Crypto. My name's Chris, and it's fantastic to have you back with us for another video on Christmas Day. So Merry Christmas, everybody. And um, in today's video, I'm gonna sort of talk about six projects that I expect to do really, really well in 2022. These are projects that I just don't think they've really peaked just yet. Um, so if you like this sort of content, mash that like button, subscribe if you haven't subscribed already, tapping that bell, selecting all the notifications so you never miss a video. With that said, done and out of the way, let's get down to the desktop and have a look at these six projects. So the first one that I'm going to sort of highlight to you is NuNet. Now it's up 2.16% at um, just over 11 cent, almost 12 cent. Now, you know, this is a relatively new project. The market cap is tiny. I mean, um, this is part of the reason why I think this one's going to do really, really well for the percentage of profit that's um, potentially on the table here with this particular project, right? Now, um, you know, they're basically building um, a, a sharing economy where you can um, monetize your computing uh, resources at scale and provide globally distributed, optimized computing power for decentralized networks. Now, um, a fantastic team, it has to be said, fantastic partners with singularity net singularity dow the list goes on and on um you know we talk about the the fact that we look for projects with fantastic utility this is one that we think has that um it has a fantastic team it has solid tech in the background in my opinion um and th and this is a project that you know it's so early i think you know it's one of those it's going to do really really well in 2022 Obviously, it goes without saying I'm not a financial advisor. This is just my opinion on um, you know this particular project and, and the rest of the projects in this video. Um, so you do have to go do your own research and any investment decisions you make are your own. Um, so make sure you do that research before sort of FOMOing into any project. I say this uh, for us and all other influencers in the space, right? Um, you know, but this is my opinion. This project, you know, solid team, solid tech, um, you know, it's, it's got utility and I think this one, it's so early, um, you know, with a really, really small market cap currently, um, it has all the hallmarks of, of a project that's going to do really, really well in the short, medium and long term. So um, do let me know uh, your thoughts and opinions on this particular project. It had to make it into this list. Um, you know, as you'll, you'll see with all of these projects, you know, they are solid um you know in the fact that their technology is is just something else right um the teams I, f I feel are solid as well um and they have utility right in the real world so um you know if you're new to the channel and you're trying to get a feel you know as to to what we're all about you know this is what we're looking for right we're looking for projects just like this um so do let me know in the comments below what your thoughts and opinions are um really do like this project um and there is a airdrop right so we did a video recently on an airdrop so you can get some of these tokens uh, if you hold agi x you keep them in a private wallet right so do check out our video on how to participate in that again it's a fantastic opportunity to get some new net tokens some ntx tokens um you know and uh you know nick and myself always partake in in these uh airdrops you know the the estelle one was was phenomenal right so yeah um do check that out okay moving on the next one has to be avalanche now again another project where nick and myself we talked about this one you know really early on i think it was less than 15 dollars a coin right and there wasn't many people really talking about this project at all right in the space and um, nick uh, has sort of given our price prediction of over 220 dollars i think it's 225 dollars uh, price target for for this one again that was at like you know before it was less than a uh, hundred dollars right and um you know, we're really passionate that these uh, targets are going to get taken out now i see other influencers sort of bad mouthing um other influencers in the space because you know they're putting really high price predictions out there like ada at like ten dollars for example um but you know their models are are flawed right i think anybody you know nick and myself could have put out um that we thought ada was going to go to two dollars and look like you know we're, we're the bee's knees right but you know we truly believe that these uh price targets are achievable um and you know you've seen this with solana when we we called out 185 dollars um 
you know nobody was calling out those sorts of prices when we were um and you know we'll be right about many others okay so uh yeah it's, it's interesting but you know this is a, another project again a solid team right you'll see you know throughout this whole video the sort of projects we're looking for solid team solid tech and um you know utility that's starting to really build up now so um if this is one that you haven't looked at do dig into it um you know i, I really do encourage you to to do research on on avalanche right again it's a solid project that i expect to do remarkably well uh, in 2022 you know like I'm, I'm calling out projects where i think that, you know that they are going to do really really well right um yeah we talk about the likes of v chain and, and various others and i think they're going to do as well uh, they're going to do well as well um but i do think that these ones really do stand out you know amongst the crowd right for for 2022 um, so yeah do let me know what you think in the comments below about this particular project i mean um again it's it's low cost eco friendly um, and again, you've got lots of D apps now building on um, Avalanche. So do sort of dig into this one. I do, like I say, think it's going to do really well. You've got some comparisons there and, and all that usual stuff, right? But um, yeah, really interested to get your views and opinions on Avalanche. Moving on, Multivag. I think we were one of the first to really call this particular project out. It's um, just over one cent currently, and that is... You know it, we've seen i think it was close to three cent at one point and um you know we've got smart contracts now again it's very similar to, to what we talk about solid tech right and um, fixes a lot of the issues with ethereum right it's basically ethereum 2.0 it's here already um we're starting to see hackathons now hopefully we'll start to see some marketing you've got nfts and um we're going to start to see more and more projects and dApps start to launch on multivac so really exciting times i know that there's a little bit of fear in in the space when it comes to to multivac uh, in regards um if you look here um some confusion around the circulating supply it's actually about 7.2 billion not 3.59 uh, because this here on market uh, coin market cap doesn't include what's being staked um, which is almost 4 billion so a lot of it's out of circulation so it doesn't really take a lot to move the the needle and again it's really really small on the market cap again we expect big things from from multivac on this channel um, but again like i say i'm not a financial advisor so um, do go do your own research but you know i think if you dig into to here i mean there's three different um papers here your technical white paper your sharding yellow paper and your programming purple paper multivac have sort of gone against the grain and tried to fix the issues um you know and, and they're really difficult issues to to resolve um, and i think they've done it so um it's one of those do dig into this project huge backers from from the likes of uh, kucoin and, and so on um so yeah do dig into it um i really do encourage you to do some research on multivac <clears throat> moving on and um i want to talk about harmony right so yeah it's got a big market cap it's not the biggest out of all of the ones that i'm highlighting today <clears throat> but there's just so much going on i don't think i think at like just under 25 cent i do think we're going to see much more gains from from harmony you know i think one dollar is definitely on the cards um if they continue on the you know the the path that they're on um we've got lots and lots of funding available we're starting to see a, an immense number of projects starting to build on harmony we're going to have the bitcoin uh bridge shortly as well so there's just so much going on right and um with the the funding that's now available for for harmony the hackathons the events the DAOs, um we're really starting to to see things really sort of coming together now and i think um you know this is a project where the community is heavily involved in you know decision making and, and moving this uh project forward so um i am personally really excited about harmony i do think that this is one um, we, I mean, we called this out at like half a cent. I do expect huge, huge things. And I think, you know, this is like the second or third, um, I guess, uh, biggest gains that we've seen from, from a project from when we first got into it. Um, yeah, but it's still got huge potential. So um, do let me know in the comments below what your thoughts and opinions are on Harmony. I think we are going to start to see much um, better... Um, 
marketing. I think we are going to see um, much more engagement. And I think we're already starting to see that, I think, is the, the point. So um, it's still early, um, but I am so encouraged about what I'm seeing currently uh, when it comes to, to Harmony. So moving on, we've got Singularity Dow. Now, I think this one's going to do really, really well in a bear market. Now, at $1.43, I mean, if we go back, I think we've seen this at over like $5. Yeah, $5.64. Um, I think it was actually higher than that. So again, um, a small market cap. Again, I expect really, really big things uh, for, for this project. We've now got the, um, if I launch the app here, so we've now got the Dyna sets here, right? So you know, it's a fantastic um, project, but this is really going to start to um, level the playing field. Um, so this is basically like a, a hedge fund on the blockchain, basically. And it utilizes AI and machine learning in order to, to basically trade. Um, and, you know, you can benefit from you know the artificial intelligence and machine learning and over time it only gets better and better so it really does level the playing field for retail investors so for that very reason i expect this one to uh, perform immensely well um and at the moment it's not performing to to the levels that i i anticipate that it will um you know the five um six dollars um even that i kind of feel is is underperforming in comparison to where this project can go um so yeah it's an interesting project again solid tech again solid team um and again fantastic use case and utility and the utility is just building and um, building so um yeah expect big things from singularity dow a project that we we do really like on this channel um, but do let me know in the comments below what your thoughts and opinions are. Really interested to, to, to understand how you feel about Singularity Dow. Moving on to the uh, sixth and final project that I'm going to highlight here. And it has to go um, probably against the grain and, and say Cardano, right? Um, getting a, a lot of bad press over the, the last few months after the announcement of smart contracts. But, you know, I think... We're starting to see dApps and um, projects, you know, really getting close to, to launching. So I think, you know, 30 days, 40 days time, you know, we're going to have um, the first set of uh, different uh, dApps and projects launching on Cardano. And I think that's going to be a game changer. And I really do expect huge gains uh, when it comes to, to Cardano. Um, and I don't care what other influencers in the space say whether they disagree with some of the price predictions or not, we will all see, um, you know, come the, the the peak of the bull run, who's right and who was wrong. And uh, I'm quite happy to to put my hands up and say I'm wrong if I am. Um, but, you know, we haven't seen what um, is about to happen just yet. And I think this project has immense technology, right? And um, I think um, Charles and, and the team, I think, are just immense. And um, for me that the utility in the real world is is huge. So um, I expect big things. Um, you know, if the, the price targets of like $10 plus don't get taken out in this particular bull cycle, I expect those to, to you know, snowball, uh, I guess, in an effect for, for the next uh, bull market. So um, again, long-term, huge expectations for Cardano. Um, so yeah, really interested to get your views and opinions on Cardano. I know there's going to be a lot of people saying it's a, a dead project, but I really don't uh, align with that. I think at $1.44, it's massively undervalued. Um, you know, people sold at like three, uh, just under $3, um, you know, fair dues. Um, but I imagine they bought back in much, much lower. So um, an interesting project. Um, I do expect it to do really well. And uh, I think we're edging closer and closer to, to seeing some of that price discovery. Um, but yeah, really interested to get your views and opinions in the comments below. Um, now, obviously, that's only six projects. And, you know, we haven't included the likes of VeChain. Again, another project that I think is going to do really, really well. 
you know there's polka dot i think they do really well um also um so yeah i hope this uh video was um supportive educational um and uh, you enjoyed the content if you did mash that like button subscribe if you haven't subscribed already tapping that bell selecting all the notifications so you never miss a video and i will catch you in the next one take care